Peacock 45 here doing a close-up of the Kimber Warrior yes full size 5 inch 1911 by Kimber and the rails and the whole nine yards the uh, basics of uh, what make a 1911 a little bit more old shootable and uh, you know things that uh, you want if you really want to shoot it a lot maybe compete with it or for the ideal combat gun as Kimber says this gun is ready for anything got your beaver tail got your uh, front serrations your night sights it's a pretty nice grip so it's a pretty good uh, little package here you've probably seen it we've uh, shot it once already we're gonna try it again we're gonna shoot some Wilson combat magazines which have a really good reputation I've always had great luck with them so uh, let's put them on I put my ears on and take a couple of shots here at ultra long range <laughs> whoa <laughs> oh don't you love the big holes the 45 puts in a can <laughs> yeah those Wilson mags are great Try that can again. I love those big 45 caliber holes. Whoa! Oh man, I was looking forward to plaking that thing a bit more. Took off for the next county. <laughs> oh, there's one growing out of that tree. Got some big holes in it. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, I think I have a couple more mags here. Yeah. Let's try a can some more. <laughs> oh yeah. The old ballastol can looks good with big holes in it too, doesn't it? Wow, we've just about depleted our targets. Oh we have a I think it's a cascade container there full of water. So Hope I don't get a shower out of this. <laughs> oh yeah, pretty nifty little gun. Yeah, those mags work great. So we got Ambi uh, safeties, full nine yards on this baby. Pretty nice uh, gun, Kimber Warrior. It is ready to go to war. Life is good.